Hello guys, this is Virag from Bionic Buzz and tonight we are here in the Beverly Hilton on a very special red carpet because uh, this is the top award ceremony of the makeup artist and the hairstylist. So please stay with us, stay tuned because you might see some superstars on the red carpet tonight also. Hi Sarah, I'm Virag from Bionic Buzz and you were you earned a nomination tonight for the House of Gucci. What is already about uh, look and design, so uh, how did you prepare for this work? Uh, you know, preparing for House of Gucci was like a real love letter to my craft because I got to not only research a real woman and like what her journey was, but also it was a period film that took place over 30 years. So I got to research all the different eras of makeup in Italy and um, bring, bring like a sense of realism to it so that you were never distracted by the makeup. But it was something that only uh, adds to Gaga's performance and never takes away from it. So I'm really proud that I feel like we accomplished that. So it was your responsibility in the movie uh, Lady Gaga's look? What's that? Lady Gaga's look was your responsibility in the movie? Yes. Okay, do you have some connection with the star when during work? So when um, did she, I mean, I'm curious if she could give you any any advice or did you discuss with her also or with just the director? Oh no, uh, I completely created it with Gaga. Uh, the first meeting I had with her, she said to me uh, that she didn't want to see Lady Gaga on the screen. And uh, that's a tall order because together we have created thousands of looks over the decade of our work together. So um, it, it was a lot of research and I feel at the end of the day I did a great job because I was able to look on that screen and I didn't see my friend Lady Gaga that I know so well. I saw her performance shine through and that means I did my job. Did you or her have, a, or she has a, a favorite look in the movie, one of the scene or something? Uh, yes. It's a scene where she's arguing uh, outside her daughter's school, Alessandra. And uh, I feel like she looks, you can see the pain in her eyes and that she's becoming unraveled. And she, um, you can just see all the emotion. And that, I think that by far is my favorite scene in the movie. That and I also love uh, the courtroom scene. Like that gave me chills. She looked so much like her. <laughs>